Hey you guys, welcome back to the channel, bringing you the brand new Venture 200 electronic fuel injection go-kart. This is supplied by both Potassi and Apollo. This is called the Venture 200 electronic fuel injection. This go-kart at one time was designed carbureted, so you no longer now have to uh, deal with any of the screw adjustments on your typical carburetor. This is electronic fuel injection. This so far is becoming one of the most popular mid-size go-karts for family, adventure, off-roading, fun, exploring. It has a, about just over two gallon gas tank over here. It has a nice solid uh, rear rack. Over here has a plastic cap on this side over here. Now this engine, they call it a 200, but it comes out to approximately uh, 169. about a 169 cc. We're going to take it for a test drive here in a minute. I'm going to cover some of the working features. You can see it has a solid rear axle here in the back here. It does have disc brakes, hydraulic disc brakes over here. Rear swing arm does include Zerk fittings, which is nice to have for longevity purposes. We uh, go towards uh, the front over here too. You got Zerk fittings here on the upper control arms where my uh, finger's at. Now, it's cold out here today, you guys, doing this uh, review on this. Showing you guys this cart. It's about 15, uh, 20 degrees. Another Zerk fitting. There's some lower Zerk fittings on, right below, correct, Tyson? Yeah, right up underneath where the uh, control arms are. Right up underneath on where the control arms are. There's some additional Zerk fittings. As you can see, the control arms. This is very well made. This uh, has LEDs here in the front. has blinker systems on it. Again, electronic fuel injection. It has fat tires in the back. It's the 22 10 tens, and then the... Uh, fronts here are the 21.7 tents has like nice really good looking uh, upgraded wheels on it cool custom style it has the five point uh, harnesses on here nice to have keep uh, keep you nice and tight inside while you're out there enjoying the off-roading has an adjustable rear seat uh, adjustable uh, driver's seat here let's show them how that works Tyson all right well just like with most other seats just pull a little lever and slide it up there you go so the driver's seat does adjust side view mirrors on here which can be adjusted as well rack and pinion steering get electronic fuel injection so you're not going to be dealing with that typical carburetor issues this just starts right up perfect for higher elevations for uh hot weather cold weather it doesn't really matter efi is just great to, and a lot of these uh, atv companies in china are transitioning to that so it's fantastic it's great to hear they're doing that. It does have dampeners on the shocks over here as well in the rear, as shown here on this side as well. And then the fronts have the same feature as well. This right here is your shifter, so you have a neutral position, forward and reverse. I'm sorry, this is your uh, this is your e-brake, parking brake, and then this is your shifter right here, you guys. So I take that back. This is right here. So this right now is in the neutral position. It has your forward. Then your reverse position right here. You got your pedals over here. Again, hydraulic brakes all the way around. Disc brakes. This says go for the kiddies and stop. I mean, just to remind you which one is which. So it has a nice little adjuster here as well. We can adjust the travel of this. Rack and pinion steering, as I mentioned. This is your typical control area right here. As shown, it has a digital cluster right here. We're going to turn this on here in a second. This is your shutoff button. This is your ignition switch as well. And then you could shut us off here if needed. So, uh, Tyson, let's uh, let's start it up. All right. Oh, that's right. You got to step on the foot brake to start it. Okay. So, what did you just press right here? Oh, this was the turn signal. Okay. So that's the turn signal. Yeah, the turn signal was just on. Okay. So uh, that's the uh, ignition switch, actual key switch that you're going to turn on. Now, how do we shut it off? Well, you can either use the kill button right here, or you can just turn it off with the key. Okay, that's fantastic. Now, what do, what do we see right here for the steering? Oh, this is an adjustable steering column, so you can actually adjust the height. Look at that, you guys. Now, how many go-karts have that? Not too many from China. So these are these upgrades that they're doing now. I mean, this is the Venture 200. Look at how nice that is. So it gives you uh, leg room if you're a, a larger size person and or have uh, a need to have the steering wheel a little bit higher. You have this mm -hmm. ability to adjust it right here. 
All right, and how about that digital cluster? We're gonna walk around here. Right. Let's see how that looks here. What's this green light there? Oh, that's just shift indicator, telling you it's in neutral right now. Okay. So we need to go into forward. All right, and then uh, why, don't you turn, why don't you turn it on yeah. again? You have your, okay, so All you can right. see that's on. So you have your reverse indicator, then you have your forward indicator here as well. Uh, let's see the blinkers uh, on blinkers? it. Blinkers, okay. Oh, we got our left and right here. Okay. Got the other side now. Go ahead. Turn them on, both on. There it goes. Okay. And let's check to see what the back. The backs have blinkers as well, you guys. So this is really set up nice, you guys. It's a full feature go kart. If you're looking for great value, uh, off roading fun, you want a vehicle that's going to take you out in the desert area. Uh, fire roads, uh, the foothills of any forestry land. This is a lot of fun. It's a full size, mid size, full size. So, Tyson, what's how tall are you? Uh, about five ten. So he's about five ten. So it gives you an idea, and he fits in there pretty comfortably. So you can probably fit about up to about six two, probably no more than that, comfortably. Again, he has plenty of leg room over there. It uh, has a second seat over here for your passenger. Again, the passenger seat does not adjust, but the driver's seat does adjust. Full padded uh, roll bar over here. Nice uh, canopy top here that's included on it. Again, they, these little grommets area here, this allows you to uh, put a light bar on here. So it's, uh, it's pre-set in case you wanted to put a light bar. Here, run some additional wires. Now we uh, determined that the uh, stator system on here, the charging alternator system is what, about 18? Uh, about, uh, almost 20 amps. Almost 20 amps, so it does have plenty of power to power up any lighting systems or any other type of system you want to put up on the, on this uh, go kart. So keep that in mind. Throw on these LEDs over here in the front. Look how bright that is too. It has LEDs here in the front. Again, now keep in mind when you order this online, and I did a video just recently a few days ago on what it looks like when it arrives. If you guys are interested, if you're out of state. Check out that video because it does arrive in a very large crate. Assemblies required and not uh, setup instructions are not included, but they do label the hardware that's included on that. So keep that in mind. And also, a very good point to point out batteries are not included for some reason on these. So we as a dealer had to supply our own batteries. So expect that. I confirmed that with the uh, supplier, which was Potassium Apollo. They do not include the batteries on this particular unit when you purchase one so be prepared to buy a battery we're using a true gel technology which is a 7 abs battery on this particular model and it powers it up just fine so uh what else do we got to point out on here anything else um, we got a side view we have a rear view mirror over here okay. yeah and then there's the two side view mirrors as well and we got the two side view mirrors here rear view mirror here solid uh, roll cage over here so he's going to take this for a ride and get EFI, you guys, electronic fuel injection. And uh, it got a parking brake feature on here as well. Just over two gallon gas tank, always use 91. So we got the uh, parking brake over here. And then we got the shifter over here. All right, take it for a spin. All right. Again, it was snowing all week, you guys. Now this would be a lot of fun to do some donuts on the snow. Look how bright the LEDs are on it. 169 it comes out to. They call it the, the Venture 200 electronic fuel injection. It runs real smooth, has a lot of pep. That EFI really makes a difference on it. And it's not, not noisy at all, it's really quiet. So that gives you a little sample of a test ride. Now we're not going to take it out in the snow and do any donuts. This is just for review and sample purposes. It has, so what do you think of the power? That's pretty good. For a that's one, that's one six, for size, yeah. 169, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, hey, you guys, check this out. If you're out of state, always remember, it gets shipped to you, drop shipped for you direct from the supplier's warehouse. Instructions are not included, but you can assemble it, or I always recommend hiring a professional mechanic to do it properly. Tyson, what do you think of the setup here? Uh, it was. Not, it actually went really smooth. Okay, so relative to the other other the Chinese go karts. Uh, relative to the other ones, much better. Okay, so yeah. the the fit and finish. Yeah, the fit and finish was much better. Okay, so keep that. 
What was that? Well, the parts actually just fit together without having to modify anything. There you go, because a lot of times when you order these Chinese go-karts, a lot of the parts just don't fit together perfectly, and you got to make some modifications. So again, this is supplied by both Apollo and Vitassi. It's called the Venture 200 Electronic Fuel Injection. I'm really happy with this one. This is going to be a fantastic seller over here. If you guys are out of state, call me before to verify availability i'll get you the best price possible get this shipped to you crated box watch my video which i'll place it on the top here so you guys can click that and watch that video i have the videos about the unboxing of the venture 200 find me on instagram at scooter atv sales if you guys need some universal chinese parts it's called scooter atv parts.com hey tyson thanks for the uh help with reviewing this test drive you give it a thumbs up all right, so hey, you guys, we'll see you guys soon. Take care. Bye-bye.